Taarifa za KTN leo michezo wagombeaji wa kiti cha wenye kiti katika shirikisho la Kandanda humu nchini wamefanya kikao ili kujadili utata wa uchaguzi wa FKF pamoja na usimamizi wa soka wakiongozwa na mwenyekiti wa zamani wa shirikisho la soka barani Afrika ama Afrika ya Mashariki Nicholas Musonye na mwanachama wa bodi ya bandari FC Twaha Mbarak viongozi hawa wamesisitiza kwamba mwenyekiti wa FKF hayuko ama yupo mamlakani kinyume na sheria We want to have clear road map for elections For these elections to take place in a free and fair manner this current office cannot do it I have said it before and we repeat it as a team The current office cannot organize credible election. We had better have a caretaker committee for some time. Rais wa shirikisho eh bwana Mwendwa hana uwezo wote wa kuendesha ofisi bila kamati yake ama executive yake ambao ni neck member. Kwa hivyo lolote jambo lolote ambalo wanaendelea sasa hiyo itakuwa ni kinyume sheria na nafikiri E, sheria zita, zitachukuliwa sisi pia kama wagombeaji tutaweza kurudi kule kule mahakamani e, SDT kama vile sheria ima, imeamrisha wale wanani support wasiponiona pale wasiwe wasiwe wamekasirika wale wana support wenzangu ikiwa mwenzangu hata kuwa hapo tusikasirike kwa sababu we want we, we, want, we, want, we really want the game to win this time round we are playing our part They must play their part. The legal procedures have take played their parts so that we can come to an all conclusive roadmap. And that includes therefore it will be after the nominations that we will have the number of those who shall have been cleared having met the threshold to now turn from aspirants to candidates. Kunyeneko Mary Wanjiku ambaye ni mchezaji wa safu ya kati katika timu ya soka ya Makolanda za ameapa kuwa yupo tayari kukabiliana na kila aina ya changamoto mbele yake ikiwemo kukataa ombi la wazazi wake la kumtaka anzishe familia hadi atakapotimiza ndoto ya kuichezea timu ya kinadada ya Arsenal kule Uingereza. Rutuno Kunyike anatuarifu zaidi. Tangu akiwa mchanga nyota wa Makolanda FC Mary Wanjiku maarufu akijulikana kama Shiku Shikaya alisimama kidete kukuza taaluma yake ya soka azimio lake kuu ikiwa ni kupata fursa ya kuichezea timu ya taifa ya Kenya Harambe Starlets nilikuwa na namfuata ndugu yangu akienda mazoezi nilikuwa mdogo sana sasa yeye ndio alinispire nikaanza kumfuata hivyo lakini kuna time ilifika wazazi wakakata waka nicheze ball sasa ikafika gamali tukaenda tukachaguliwa kwenda kuwakilisha Kenya tukacheza UG sasa hapo mamangu akaona eh kumbe anaweza kuwa na talent hii talent inaweza msaidia awali mchezaji huyo wakati aligaragaza soka katika timu ya Thika Queens na Thika Rangers kabla ya kuungana na timu ya Makolanders anapochezea hadi wa leo Taaluma yake katika soka ilishamiri alipobahatika kuiwakilisha Kenya nchini Norway katika michuano ya kimataifa ya soka mitaani ambapo Kenya ilimaliza katika nafasi ya tatu miongoni mwa timu na nne. kumbukumbu atakazo hifadhi milele ilikuwa ni exposure poa sana kwangu na bado ilinichangia life yangu at least tulipata kitu yenye naweza sema ilinisaidia she continues working hard cause she is in Uh, the peak age for playing football she can do so well Kero la unyanyapaa wa Kandanda unaokuwa na dhana ya kuwa soka sio mchezo wa wanawake ni moja wapo wa changamoto zilizotia doa ukuaji wake Isitoshe utiriri wa mara kwa mara wa pendekezo kuolewa na kuanza familia ni jambo linalomkosesha usingizi kila leo Njua naona eh kama mimi mdogo wangu wako hadi na mtoto lakini mimi bado sina so anashindaga wakiza eh na utatuletea lini hivyo sasa mm. lakini nawaambia watulie jukarian yangu si yao 
Kwa binti mrembo Mary Wanjiku, vikwazo na changamoto ni sehemu ya maisha ila kwake yeye atazidi kujifunga kibwebwe hadi atakapotimiza ndoto yake kuchezea soka barani Ulaya. Rutuno Kwenyike, KTN Michezo.